back and at halftime, the coaches really told us to dial in and get focused offensively and defensively and just to come out strong with a lot of energy. So that's what we tried to do and just worked out. We're just um, focusing on finishing, finishing everything, finishing plays defensively and offensively, finishing, grabbing the rebound with two hands, bring it down. It's just going to come down to hustle plays, and we understand that. So as the end of the season comes, we just have to keep playing hard. Just in practice, we've been highlighting, like playing as a team, just coming together, and this is the part of the season when you come together and fall apart, and we're just trying to gel more. So we come out here, we have confidence in all of our players that come out here, so we know to get in a position to score, and we just trust them and give them the ball in the right places. First of all, it's a, it's a good win for for a great cause. I mean, it was our pink game to support breast cancer and breast cancer awareness and research. So whenever we can come out in, in front of our fans and perform the way that we did for a good cause, I'm very proud of that. But you're right, coming off of uh, just a stretch. We're in February. This is the time of year where teams either break or they come together. And, and, and that's one thing that we've been talking to our team. It's a long season. You think about it for our freshmen. This is new. You know, for our seniors in three months, they're thinking about, you know, the future possibly. But we just wanted them to hone in on all of their hard work and what they've been doing from from the summer until now and just letting us, letting us play our best basketball as, as we head into March. Well, they have the green light. And, um, you know, every on any given night you can have a bad night. But we talk to them about doing other things. If, if you're not shooting, you can be a very good rebounder. You can take charges, the hustle plays. And that was one of the keys tonight. We had to, to just get off to a good start defensively. I feel like in the last couple of, of games, our defense has been slacking a little bit. And so we wanted to come out and, and really establish who we are defensively. And I thought we did that beautifully tonight. Well, tonight we told them. And that's one thing that we tell our kids day in and day out where we are in the stand what we're playing for and we told them that this was a must win we put it on the board in bold and some co some coaches tell their kids and some don't but you got to know what you're playing for and it, it holds us in, in the standings we want to continue to climb as we head into into, into March and into CA championships so again but as you know it's one game at a time you know this week we you know we head to Wilmington and, and we haven't even seen them yet so this will be our first time seeing them and on any given night, it's anyone's game. So we just have to be focused and, and um, just together, stay together and stay disciplined. Our pace, our turn.